Hello there, and welcome to Simple Sequence 1 Heart Openers, a short 12-minute sequence designed to open up the shoulders and the ribs to help you deepen your back bends. To begin, find your hands at heart center, kneeling on your mat, and ground yourself into your breath. Spending a few moments here, feeling into your body, and tuning to that place inside of you of compassion, empathy, understanding, kindness, and love. From here, interlace your fingers, turn the palms to face you, and reach the hands away from you, dropping your chin to your chest, reaching the backs of the hands away from you as much as you can, see if you can feel a stretch behind the heart, between the shoulder blades. Turning the palms out, reach the palms up until they are directly above your shoulders, bend the elbows and take the left elbow behind you bending your right elbow out to the side, feeling a stretch in your left tricep. Straightening the arms, bending the right elbow behind your head, left elbow out to the side. Straightening the arms to the sky again, this time with the arms straight, lean to the right, look underneath the left armpit. Coming back to center, lean to the left, looking underneath the right armpit. Coming back to center, release the hands, taking the hands behind you, and once again, interlacing the fingers. Bend the elbows and take the hands to your left side and lean your left ear towards your left shoulder. You can deepen the stretch by pressing your hands into the left side body and drawing the right shoulder away from your right ear. Straightening the arms, stretching sides, taking both hands over to the right side, leaning the right ear towards your right shoulder, drawing the left shoulder away from your left ear. Taking both hands behind you, lift the belly, lift the heart up, and look up, reaching the hands away from you. Folding forward, forehead to the mat, roll onto the top of your head, and reach the hands further away from your tailbone. Releasing the hands underneath you, press up to a tabletop, finding your shoulders directly over your wrist, hips over knees, inhale to your cow pose, exhale to your cat. Inhale, cow, looking up, exhale, cat, rounding the spine. Do a few more cat cows on your own breath and timing. Returning to a neutral spine, sit back on your heels, arms outstretched in front of you, forehead returns to the mat for a child's pose, but in this child's pose, bend the elbows and take the hands to the shoulders. Returning the hands to the mat, Walk the hands over to the right, finding a stretch in the left side body. Walking the hands to center and all the way to the left, pulling forward with the right hand this time, finding a stretch in your right side body.
coming back to center, come back into your tabletop, and come into melting heart pose by walking the hands out in front of you and lowering the chest towards the mat. You might have your forehead on the mat or look past your fingertips. And like we just did in our child's pose, walk the hands over to the right, pulling forward with your left hand. Coming back to center, walk your hands over to the left this time, pulling forward with your right hand. Coming back to center, to your melting heart pose. Drop the elbows to the mat, bring the palms together, and take the palms behind your head, pressing the elbows into the mat, and further drawing the hips back. Palms return to the mat, elbows to the mat. Step the feet out behind you and drop the tailbone to the ground to come into a sphinx pose, drawing the shoulders away from the ears, lifting the head up and looking up, pulling your heart forward to make space in the lower back. Lowering down, hands under shoulders, take your right arm out, bend your left leg, reach the left leg up, and then over to the right. Switching to the other side, the left arm extends out, right leg bends, right leg reaches up, and then over to the left. Breathing here. Coming back to center, taking both hands behind you, interlacing the fingers, lifting the heart up and reaching for your heels. releasing the hands underneath you, and pressing back for another child's pose. Coming back to your tabletop. This time, dropping your elbows to the mat, tucking your toes and lifting the hips high to the sky for a dolphin pose. Pressing forearms into the mat to lift the hips up as much as you can. Returning the knees to the mat, returning to tabletop, tucking the toes, hips to the sky once again, this time downward facing dog. From downward dog, take your right leg high to the sky, and plant the right foot between your hands. Let the left knee drop, uncurl the left toes, and inhale your arms up to the sky. From here, right hand comes to your right hip crease or perhaps the ground as you lean to the right, looking underneath your left armpit. Taking both hands to the mat, Framing your front foot, drop the hips back for a half Hanumasana pose or half splits pose. Planting the right foot back in the mat, take the right hand to the inside of the leg, pivot the heel out, point the toes out, reach the right hand back to find the back foot, and pull that back left foot as close as you can to your tailbone. Right hand returns to the mat and step back, downward facing dog. 
for the other side. Left leg extends up high to the sky. Plant the left foot between your hands. The, the right knee drop. Inhale the arms up. From here, left hand lowers to the left hip or the mat. Right arm reaches up and over, looking underneath your right armpit. Taking both arms back to center, hands to the mat, framing your front foot. Drop the hips back, folding over your front leg. Coming forward, left hand shifts to the inside of your left leg. Left foot pivots out, points out, the left knee falls out. Left hand reaches back, finds your back foot, and pulls the back foot in. Both hands to the top of your mat, step back, downward facing dog. Knees find the mat. Elbows find the mat. One more dolphin pose. This time, take your right leg up to the sky, keeping the hip square to the mat. Right foot lowers down. Left leg comes high to the sky. Left foot comes back to the mat. Knees drop to the mat. Sitting back, child's pose. Hands at your heels this time. Resting here, coming back to your breath, back to your body, back to your heart in this moment. Rolling up, returning your hands to your heart, closing by returning to your heart center. 